Accountability helps ensure that every employee will take responsibility for their performance and behaviors. When we implement goals and communicate with one another, we can achieve powerful results. Building an accountable workplace requires strong teamwork and collaboration. Every team member must have a strong understanding of the values of the company and recognize this importance in order to attain success. Our Accountability in the Workplace course will provide your participants with informative tools and practical strategies. These skills can be used to help empower your team to work towards achieving the benefits of accountability. Accountable employees fuel performance, productivity, and generate an overall enhanced workplace. Accountability in the Workplace Module 1 Getting Started Welcome to the Accountability in the Workplace Workshop. Accountability helps to ensure that every employee will take responsibility for their performance and behaviors and continue to manage this responsibility. When we implement goals and communicate with one another, we can achieve powerful results. Building an accountable workplace requires strong teamwork and collaboration. Every team member must have a strong understanding of the values of the company and recognize the importance of their dedication in order to attain success. This course will provide you with informative tools and practical strategies that can be used to help empower the team to work towards achieving the benefits of accountability. Accountable employees will fuel performance and productivity and generate an enhanced workplace. Module 2. What is Accountability? Accountability is an essential factor in an exceptional high-functioning workplace. It is very important to build a team that fosters workplace accountability, since accountability will be reflected in the accuracy and efficiency of the work produced by the employees. Accountability ensures that each employee is invested in the success of the business and that they will strive to seek results that are best for the team. Holding employees accountable will help to highlight the importance of the responsibilities in relation to the business. Personal accountability in the workplace will result in higher productivity, workplace satisfaction, and an overall stronger bond between the team members. Defining accountability Accountability is the acceptance and obligation to carry out a responsibility. This includes being answerable for decisions, actions, and the outcomes. The term accountability often carries a negative connotation. However, accountability is beneficial in many ways, including personal benefits, as well as benefits for a team or organization. Accountability represents a form of trust, which is a fundamental trait for employees to have. The practice of accountability can involve power being transferred from one individual to another. In the workplace, being accountable means to take this power and own it. In other words, employees should respect their everyday obligations to perform their best and work towards building the business. Accountability will help to avoid negligence or misconduct in the workplace. Each employee is accountable to carry out specific tasks. However, the employer will also be accountable for controlling and directing the team. An accountable employee will have specific habits, including taking responsibility and managing this responsibility. Practicing time management skills. Avoiding excuses. Working with the other members of the team. Personal accountability. Accountability is not limited to the exchange of expectations between individuals, but it can be on a personal level as well. Personal accountability is taking full responsibility for your own actions and outcomes. This form of accountability can result in a higher level of happiness and feelings of personal achievement. Personal accountability is powerful. It is one thing to set a goal and say you are going to do it. But to actually stay committed and follow through with your goals is life-changing. Not everyone has personal accountability, but everyone is capable of having it. It is a strong skill to have that requires taking control over your thoughts and actions. Remember, you are responsible for your own success. So how are you going to reach this success? Building personal accountability includes envisioning your future, setting measurable goals, taking ownership, problem solving to find solutions, choosing appropriate attitudes and behaviors.
being held accountable. You may often hear the phrase holding someone accountable, but have you ever stopped to think about what it means to be held accountable? We hold others accountable all of the time, whether it is in the workplace or in our lives outside of work. To hold someone accountable means that you are relying on someone to produce results for a particular obligation or task that has been delegated to this person. In other words, you have expectations for this person to deliver on their commitment. As an employee, others have expectations of you the moment you accept the position. Employees are expected to arrive to work on time in the proper attire and have an appropriate attitude. The employer will delegate particular assignments over time, and it is up to you as an employee to accept and commit to your work. To be held accountable means to be personally responsible for actions, decisions, and outcomes. It is highly beneficial to hold yourself accountable. Personal accountability is a choice and mindset in which you are holding yourself accountable for your actions. This is a good way to achieve goals, increase your confidence, and grow as an individual. Effective work environments are those that create and encourage accountability, while eliminating blame. Accountability and blame are two very different terms and should not be used interchangeably. In fact, blame damages accountability. Accountability is all about constructively moving forward and focuses on what you can control. It means that you take responsibility for outcomes whether they are good or bad. Accountable individuals will gain respect from others and gain confidence in themselves. They choose to own their outcomes. In contrast to accountability, blame focuses on the past, punishment, and the shifting of responsibility onto someone else. Blame creates an unhealthy and irresponsible work environment. Unaccountable employees may choose to invest their energy in blame because they feel as though it is easier than being accountable for mistakes or because they do not want to find the underlying cause of the problem. Blame is used as a defense mechanism that focuses on who is wrong rather than what is wrong. In order to eliminate blame in the workplace, it is important to see problems as learning opportunities rather than drawbacks. Understanding the importance. Accountability has a powerful effect on the results of a business. Accountability helps to ensure that every team member has a strong understanding of the values of the business and why they are engaging in certain practices. Each employee is working towards the same overall goal. It is crucial that every individual is aware of the importance of accountability in the workplace. Otherwise, they will not understand the impact that their position has and therefore not perform adequately. If employees are not invested in accountability, then problems will arise. Lack of accountability will result in blame, conflicts, lower quality of performance, and evidently greater frustrations. Therefore, it is necessary to hold yourself responsible and motivate your team to do the same thing in order to eliminate these problems from happening. Accountability helps in building a positive, successful work culture. Jonah's boss had assigned him to do a sales analysis to determine their business's top-selling product. He understood the value of this assignment and wanted to show his boss that he is committed to his work. Jonah agreed to take on this responsibility and began by making goals for this project. His plan was to have the assignment done by the end of the week and give his boss an organized analysis. He started his assignment with a positive attitude and stuck to his initial timeline in order to get the job done. Despite having other work to do, he was able to complete the project on time because he had goals and a plan. His boss was very proud of Jonah and knew he chose the right person to hold accountable for this project. Module 3. Creating an Accountable Workplace in order to build an accountable workplace, it is imperative that every member of the team is an accountable employee. One employee's lack of accountability will damage the rest of the team. Other employees are dependent on the work you produce, so it is evident that failing to produce adequate results will cause the other members to suffer as well. An accountable workplace is one in which every individual makes accountability a core value. Employees are aware of the importance of taking ownership and responsibility for their position and how this initiative will help to further the business.
Modeling Accountability Modeling specific behaviors has a powerful effect on human development. It is a form of social or observational learning, which influences other individuals. Thus, if we want to be successful in influencing others to become more accountable, it is important to understand how to effectively model accountability. It is essential to model traits that are valuable to the workplace. It is critical to be conscious of what behaviors we are modeling to others. The behaviors modeled in the workplace can either make or break the business. Modeling good accountability requires actually having good accountability skills. Accountable people have a mindset that strives for achievement. They understand what their accountabilities are and are committed to their self, customers, work team, and everyone around them. Modeling accountability includes demonstrating skills and behaviors to others, including always being punctual and prepared, acknowledging and correcting mistakes, and using these mistakes as a learning tool, staying loyal to commitments and keeping promises, having an ownership mentality rather than a victim mentality, receiving satisfaction from accomplishment rather than praise from others, controlling their own fate. Valuing Accountability To give value to something means to consider the degree of importance. Values are important in the creation of success and building a vision. Every workplace should include accountability as a core value. This entails more than just doing our jobs, but making it a value to do better and honor commitments to others, even when problems arise. Enforcing accountability as a core value will encourage employees to stay devoted, work hard, and produce exceptional results. Employees should be aware of accountability being a core value to the business, and this principle should be reinforced over time. The front-loading benefits. Front-loading will help to boost the culture of accountability. It is the process of setting clear expectations and guidelines at the beginning of any process. It is beneficial to front-load accountability during the hiring process and address personal accountability experiences. Front-loading helps to provide specificity, give individuals a strong insight on expectations and goals, and create ownership. Employees will feel more confident and agree to take on responsibility if they are aware of what the responsibility entails and why. Front-loading accountability will generate a successful organized business. By ensuring clear expectations and directions, this will remove surprises, confusion, and misunderstandings on what the employee is supposed to be working on. Employees will also gain confidence in understanding their purpose or role. Clear expectations will help to increase job satisfaction, engagement, and productivity. Accountable employees will frequently question how they are doing and request feedback on their performance. Front-loading is beneficial in strengthening the confidence and performance in accountable employees. It helps to provide insight on knowing when they have met expectations and reached favorable outcomes. Teamwork Effective teamwork is essential for the growth of a business. In the workplace, teamwork is the collaborative efforts of each team member that assemble to meet the company's goals. Teamwork requires accountability to ensure that the work is balanced amongst colleagues and that each team member will stay loyal to their obligations. An accountable team will create a winning work environment. Teamwork means that everyone is working together, allowing more opportunities to arise. A powerful team is built on open communication, clear directions, defined goals, as well as shared goals. Each individual should be made aware of their worth and importance in the workplace and what it means to be part of a team. You cannot simply rely on other team members to get the job done. It takes the different strengths and commitments from each individual to produce a superior outcome. Team members should support and encourage one another. Teamwork is not achievable without accountability, and in turn, lack of teamwork will create hardships and failures to the business. The Accountability Cycle The cycle of accountability acknowledges the relationship between responsibility, ownership, and answerability. The practice of accountability follows a particular sequence of events, 
in which there is a strong connection between each component in the cycle. It is effective in creating empowerment and expanding personal growth. Let's break down the cycle. Establishing Goals and Expectations The cycle begins by establishing goals and expectations for the business, including defining the mission and action plans. Delegation, creating ownership. Who is going to be accountable? Each individual must be aware of what their job is and given structure on their obligations. Monitoring, measuring. It is important to assess how each employee is doing. Assistance and feedback may be required. Evaluation, feedback. Evaluation includes determining whether obligations were successfully completed and the overall performance of the individual and their work. It may include corrective or constructive feedback or positive reinforcement. Penelope's boss assigned her the job of training the new employee Isla. Her boss knew she would be a great mentor since she models a responsible, courteous employee. Isla followed and watched Penelope closely during her first week. She noticed that Penelope would always arrive at work early and prepared took ownership with confidence, and worked collectively with every member of the team. Penelope's positive attitude was contagious in the office. At the end of the week, Isla felt relaxed and confident about her new job. She knew she was trained from an excellent employee who showed her the values of the business. Isla learned many things from Penelope, but the thing that stood out the most was how Penelope would not let problems or negativity get in the way of reaching her company goals. Penelope used feedback as a way to boost her performance, and problem-solved her way through anything. Isla thanked Penelope for her help, and began her new work journey by using the skills that Penelope had modeled for her. Module 4. The C's of Accountability Workplace objectives and goals are hard to achieve if we lack accountability. There are five principles we can follow to help build team dynamics in association with accountability and leadership. These principles are easy to incorporate and make a big impact on the outcome of powerful accountability skills. The five C's of accountability help employees to stay focused, confident, and consistent in order to grow as an employee and obtain success as a business. Accountability requires clarification, a common purpose, communication, collaboration, and consequences. Clarification. Successful accountability requires clear, concise instructions. It is impossible to meet expectations if the employee does not have a strong understanding of the expectations. The employee should be given specific information on what they are supposed to be focusing on, how they should follow through with this task, and why the task is important to the business. The employee should verify that they have a full grasp of what it is they are being held accountable for. It cannot be assumed that the employee has a full understanding of their expectations, simply because they have not been told. Clarifying expectations is a two-way street. Not only is it the responsibility of the manager to give direction, but it is the responsibility of the employee to ask questions if these directions were unclear. Oftentimes, failure is the result of misunderstandings or miscommunication. Clarification will help the business to Ensure everyone in the workplace has a clear understanding of expectations and goals. Save time and money. Reduce stress and frustration. Build trust and relationships. Common Purpose The most effective business teams are those who share a common purpose. Each employee should understand what the business stands for and the importance of connecting the team's objectives. Typically, employees are told what it is that they should do but are not informed about why they should be spending their time and efforts on these projects. Discussing the purpose in relation to long-term goals will help to enhance overall accountability and productivity. Employees should never find themselves wondering, what's the point? As this will lower their motivation and engagement, a common purpose will significantly influence levels of accountability. Communication. Effective communication in the workplace should not just be about telling or transferring information, but it is critical that this information is understood. 
The message or directions must be clear, otherwise mistakes are likely to happen. To ensure accountability among employees, communication must be concise and consistent. The communication process is ongoing and begins with a conversation about expectations. The work environment should be a welcoming environment, meaning that employees should not be afraid to ask questions and give feedback in regards to their obligations. If employees are having difficulty understanding instructions, the delegate must be willing to answer questions or elaborate on instructions. Communication is important. It helps to guide and motivate one another and align every team member so that they stay committed and work towards the same goals for the business. Collaboration. Individuals who attempt to handle many projects at once will often lead to burnout and failure. It is vital to collaborate and work as a team that listens and supports one another if you wish to build a successful team that achieves long-term goals. Every employee has their own responsibilities that they are accountable for, based on their skills and abilities. These obligations help to contribute to the long-term objectives of the company. Simply put, collaboration is taking individual efforts and producing a significant team accomplishment. In order for collaborative practices to be successful, employees must stay accountable for their work. Successful teamwork requires collaboration, and collaboration is not possible without accountable employees. Consequences If we wish to build personal accountability, then consequences and results should be clearly established. Consequences are frequently thought of to be negative. However, consequences can include the celebration of success or positive effects from your actions. A clear understanding of the consequences will help to empower employees to strive to generate appropriate outcomes. Consequences are mandatory for accountability. If there are no consequences, then employees will not feel the need to be accountable for future assignments as well. Consequences for unsatisfactory results can include feedback or education. Additional consequences may be required if this is an ongoing issue of failing to deliver results. This can include an employee continuously being late for work. Employees should not feel intimidated by consequences. They should have a clear understanding of the workplace expectations and, more specifically, what is expected of them in their particular positions or assignments. You should be recognized and celebrated for successful results, which will encourage you to confidently take on more responsibilities. Reggie and Silas were given the task of putting on a seminar for the office at the end of the week. After hours of disagreeing on ideas, they realized that they had not accomplished any plans for this seminar. At last, Reggie had decided that the arguing had gone on for far too long. He reminded Silas of the importance of putting on the seminar and that their boss was relying on them to successfully put on this event for the company. You're right, Silas said. Let's sit down and form a proper plan. Reggie and Silas sat down and reviewed the instructions they were given to ensure they were clear. They discussed their ideas and actually listened to one another. They focused on the purpose of the seminar and why it was important. By effectively collaborating and communicating to one another, Reggie and Silas were able to put on a great seminar. Their boss was proud of them for maintaining accountability and producing excellent results. Module 5 Building Ownership Ownership and accountability are fundamental elements in a successful business. Simply put, ownership is about taking initiative and understanding what needs to be done, whereas accountability is maintaining and fulfilling this ownership. Ownership and accountability will allow employees to feel invested in the success of the team, gain a sense of autonomy, and develop growth as an employee. Ownership versus accountability. The terms ownership and accountability are used frequently in the business field. Despite often being used interchangeably, the terms carry different meanings. Accountability is connected to an extrinsic motivation, whereas ownership is connected to an intrinsic motivation. A balance between accountability and ownership in the workplace is beneficial. An environment that is created from accountability 
is one in which ownership can commence and flourish. Accountability includes aligning roles, communication, evaluation, and recognition. When employees are held accountable, they are given a task and have expectations of them to successfully complete this task. With accountability, there is more pressure placed on the quality and success of the obligation that you are given. In contrast to accountability, ownership is related to initiative and autonomy. Ownership includes the choice of rights and control, in which employees have a say in whether they will own their work and goals. Those who have ownership understand why they are taking accountability and accepting the challenge. Accountability is linked to what the goals are given from an extrinsic source, as opposed to ownership being how the goals are going to be accomplished from an intrinsic source. The Ownership Mentality It is one thing to say you will take accountability and own something. But to develop an ownership mentality is the key to remaining loyal to the process. This mentality is not forced but established and includes any level of authority as an employee. There is a strong understanding of the importance of building and supporting the business. Having an ownership mentality includes being able to see the big picture or end goal. Knowing you are capable of making a difference for your business. Being motivated, driven, and taking initiative when needed. Being a team player and dedicating time to developing a team bond. Being innovative and creative in decision making. Trusting others and ensuring that others trust you. These skills do not always come naturally and can take some practice to master. Ownership requires effort and motives. A business that has many employees working with these attitudes and mindsets is a strong, thriving business. Why does it matter? When employees have a strong understanding of what it is they are working towards and why it is important, it will encourage them to work harder and aim for higher results. Ownership includes treating the company that the employee is working for as if it were their own company. This mindset increases personal accountability and responsibility. Accountability and an ownership mentality has many great benefits for the business. Employees who take ownership will help the company advance, create trusts between coworkers, and contribute to a positive, healthy work environment. The employee will also achieve personal growth and development while boosting confidence and strength in their position. The weight of micromanaging. Micromanaging means that employees are being closely monitored and controlled by managers or those of higher authority. This management style is ineffective since it damages trust and increases levels of insecurity and stress. Employees require some freedom in the workplace, allowing them to learn and grow. This negative management style does not allow employees to learn accountability, ownership, or responsibility if others are consistently directing them. Micromanaging is a contributing factor to a negative work environment that prevents initiative and discourages independent work. Employees who are being closely observed are more likely to lose concentration on the task or dismiss the importance of the task if they feel as though they cannot fully own the task. Sharing your vision. Every business has a vision or mission that they are aiming to achieve. To successfully accomplish this mission, every employee in the business needs to align to the vision. It is essential to establish a clear, concise vision and ensure that the employees fully comprehend what it is they are aiming for. Thus, it is one thing to have a vision, but if the team of employees have not been given a specific direction of what they are striving for, then they are less likely to provide appropriate results. When each employee has a strong understanding of how their role will help to contribute to objectives of the business, then they are more likely to maintain productivity, stay motivated, and encourage one another to stick to the vision. It will create a common ground for where employees should be focusing their time and efforts. Sharing a company vision is a powerful motivator that will help to guide employees towards success. Greta was getting worried about losing her job. She knew she was not the most responsible, productive employee, but she could not afford to be fired from her position. Greta knew that she needed to change. 
She decided to shift her mindset and reflect on the importance of her job. She thought about how lucky she was that she was given the opportunity for this position with the company and decided to own her work. Greta shifted her mindset to be more positive. She believed in herself and that she was capable of making a difference. She focused on the bigger picture in the business. With this new mindset, she was able to become a more accountable employee. The new Greta now shows up to work with enthusiasm, develops strategies with her team, and remains committed to her tasks. Greta is proud of herself for taking ownership and accepting accountability.